Hey guys, today I'm going to conduct a CPU throttling test with the GT Neo 3 and the Poco F4 GT Dimensity 8100 and the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1. So both are powerful chips. The GT Neo 3 is a cheaper phone than what the Poco F4 GT is. Now also, the benefit the Poco F4 has, or it should have, is the fact that it has some uh, water cooling inside so hopefully that should reduce any throttling i'm not saying it will stop throttling there might be some cpu throttling in there um, we should see better results on this maybe compared to the dimensity a100 but that's the whole reason we do these tests or why i'm why i'm doing the test uh, to see what results we get so we are going to have a cpu throttling test uh, there Let's make sure the options are exactly the same. So number of threads, 20 on both, a 15 minute test. Um, yeah, we can do that. Save. And we're pretty much good to go. Let's, um... Yeah, full brightness on both, on both um, screens. Right, guys, here we go. We're gonna start the test. Here we go. Okay, so there's just under a minute left, and wow, that is the worst throttle I've ever seen since I've been starting doing these tests. It's supposed to be keeping the phone cool, it's got water cooling technology. Um, what temperatures we've got here, if you can see that on the 41, got 41.2 there. And we've got 42.6, 42 point, oh, 41. So 42.6 at the hottest, 42.7 actually there. They both finished the test. And okay, so it looks like it's a, deg a degree cooler on the Poco F4 GT. Slightly cooler, let's feel the Yeah, they're, they're about sort of similar, but, oh, no, you're joking. You know, I cannot believe I accidentally wiped the data from that. Well, luckily, with camera trickery, we can bring it back. Okay, so those are the stats on the GT Neo 3. As you can see, all green throughout, but obviously on the Poco F4, we have red, sort of yellow, and green at the left there. Max performance on the Poco F4 was 283,000 gips, whereas the GT Neo 3 was 267,000 gips. But if you look at the average, the GT Neo 3 does come out on top with 254 compared to 216 on the Poco F4 GT. And the more alarming stat we have here, the minimum, 155,440 gips, CPU throttled to 59% of its max performance. That is a huge throttle in there. Now, I don't know whether this is the water cooling is not working. Don't know. On the GT Neo 3, the CPU throttled to 88% of its max performance. That was great, stable performance throughout with the Dimensity 8100 compared to the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1. I am very surprised. Now, obviously these tests, they are, they are extreme tests. No one's gonna be smashing this much sort of performance and power at uh, in a smartphone when they're gaming for 15 minutes. It's just not gonna happen, but it does sort of open your eyes a little bit just to, uh, you know, just to, and it just shows the Dimensity 8100 seems to be 
a, a really powerful chip operates at a very nice temperature, a cool temperature to keep that sort of constant performance. Um, whether, the, whether it's a material used in the, in the Poco F4 GT, whether the water cooling was not working correctly or it only works under certain conditions, I don't know. But this is the results I've got. These are the results for you to digest and make what you will, basically. So if we take a quick look at what settings you get within PUBG, this is PUBG New State. Um, GT Neo 3, I'm going to spin them round, put a GT Neo 3 at the top, and Poco F4 at the bottom. We go into the settings. Da, da, da. Graphics, graphics. So here we go, we both get the same, so we max frame rate. Max frame rate, ultra graphics, ultra graphics, graphics on there, graphic resolution we can put to high on both. Oh. Okay. What else? Brightness fine, standard. Yeah, save, save. Both offer the same settings throughout. Okay guys, that was my quick comparison, the GT Neo 3 and the Poco F4 GT, the CPU throttling test. Love to hear your thoughts in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this content, do consider subscribing to the channel and give the video a thumbs up. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, bye-bye.